What's up my connectors and welcome back to the channel. So today we are having a seafood mukbang but we have some new, new food alert. <laughs> Alright so this is barramundi fish. I guess I've never tried it. Kit says a type of sea bass and this is tortilla soup. I know that probably won't go together but I wanted to try it. Some green beans and the little stuff that it comes with. All of this came from Cooper's Hawk and I'm drinking my favorite coconut water, Harmless Harvest. Okay, so if you're new to the channel, if you could please hit your subscribe button and your notification bell so you'll be notified when a new video is uploaded. Don't forget to share, like, and leave me a comment. I truly appreciate it. And we also have some pretzel bread that smells so good. I just heated it up, so that's why it's in the paper towel. All right, so let me put this stuff in here. I think I was supposed to put that in there beforehand, but don't worry about it. I think it's going now. But you're gonna make it do what it do. Happy Saturday! Stay this going here. Put this in there. Oh, this is already about to melt. This is the butter for the bread. And this is tortilla strips. I'm on a soup kick, I don't know why. All right, let's jump in and taste this fish. First of all, have y'all tried Barramundi fish before? If so, where? Did you cook it? Did you get it from a restaurant? Mmm. That rice good though. Let's taste it. Y'all know how I am with fish. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Mm-hmm. That's a winner. Um, it's in a um, Thai lemongrass sauce. I'll look it up. I'll put the name up down the screen. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's good. Mmm. Mmm, tomatoes good. I got, so I got the spoon on the plate. That's how you know. I don't do a lot of fish, but I like this. And it's well done, like I like it. I don't like it when it be slimy in the middle and stuff. I know. And I'll probably say, girl, grow up. Mm -mm, grow down. Oh yeah, it's hot. I've never had this soup before. From Hoover's Hawk. I've had tortilla soup, I think from uh, Cheesecake Factory. Let's taste it. Mmm. That's good. I know I'm mixing combinations of food, but that's good. Mmm. Oh, hold on. I'll give a shout out in a minute. Hold on. Mmm. 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 That's all good. Hold on. Slow down and enjoy yourself. That fish is good. I don't know if I got this up too bright. And y'all can't see it. I'll turn it down a little bit. I like this sauce. Mm. Green beans and tomatoes. That thing that's new for me. Mm. 
Let me know if you try this little dish. At the restaurant. <laughs> he picked a good one. Okay. I might be able to trust his palate. Okay, so. I'll just get a little piece of bread. Y'all know I don't do bread, but this press the bread. You can't really not eat it. It ain't like a biscuit or nothing. Oh my goodness. I'm going to put her comment on the screen. She asked me to taste the um, lobster bisque. Because y'all know I like to get their lobster bisque. And she asked me to go to um, Texas de Brazil. So I went there in the rain. Because she said it was better. Now the only thing is. I'm going to put her name on the screen. So thank you, thank you for the recommendation. <clears throat> During the It Better Be Good series. It was good. But there was no lobster. I guess I'm used to having the lobster in it. But Kiana said she loved it. Because she don't like lobster. You know what I mean? She don't like chunks of lobster in her soup. But it had a little kick. The flavor was good. And I ate it all now. I'm getting twisted. <laughs> But yeah, she loved it. So thank you for that recommendation. And you're right, it is really good. But it is no lobster. I bought two bowls. Mm-hmm. That one is fish good. And I like sea bass. Mm, mm. Just a little something, something different. I bet y'all said, can we get back to our you? No. Nope. Yes. Yes, I just wanted to try something. I can't see me. Can y'all see me? Oh, I already put butter on here. <laughs> Somebody said, I was hoping you take that lobster tail and put it in that soup. <laughs> I should have. So what y'all doing? Chilling in the day? That's all I've been doing. Chilling. Oh, and this, this is why y'all didn't tell me. Uh, let me ask y'all this. Okay, how about, <laughs> I know y'all gonna be like, where are you so slow? Where have you been? You're evidently not in the world. Why y'all didn't tell me about Play-Doh's closet? That they buy your clothes back. I never heard of that. It came up on my YouTube recommendation. I did not know that. Have y'all ever um took clothes over there? Y'all probably couldn't see none of that up here, huh? Yeah, have y'all taken clothes over there? And sold your clothes back? Like your gently worn clothes or new clothes. She sold purses. Purses. She sold um shoes I was like oh wow I think that's a good thing because I always feel like you know putting them in the bags and just throwing them away it's like a waste of money but yeah you can sell your clothes back Or you can just, you know, if you don't feel like, want, if you don't want to do all that, you just donate them like I've been doing. 
So that was one thing. Y'all left me in the dark about. <laughs> and who was that? When we was live, she talking about something about the closet up there. <laughs> Y'all remember everything. So that was one thing. Have y'all ever taken y'all clothes back and sold them or whatever? Or do y'all just do it like me? Put them in the bag and give them away? <clears throat> oh, that fish good. Mm, mm, mm. And child, I asked them for extra sauce. That little thing they gave me. Oh, and somebody asked me what was my favorite uh, rice. It's jasmine rice. Mm. Wow, I killed that. Mm -mm, I'll get that again. So, yeah, jasmine rice is my favorite. And we also had that some. Mmm. Thank y'all for watching the video yesterday. <laughs> yeah. I appreciate y'all watching the video yesterday. Of course, and along with the live. Thank you, thank you. That was just a quick little fun video to do. Y'all talking about, I don't know about that case here. We're just trying things, okay? We're just trying things. Hey, little girl. Hello. How you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. Mmm. <laughs> then, of course, they had a debate on um, Instagram about cleaning chicken. Because they say some people don't clean their chicken right. And some people saying, why are you cleaning the chicken? It's already clean when it gets to you. <laughs> some people is like, your chicken is not clean unless you use vinegar and lemon. So they was really going back and forth. First of all, y'all know we don't cook chicken. Some people use salt. Oh, yes, he did say salt. I saw salt and lime. <clears throat> vinegar um i know they talked about that one guy that used don liquid do you know the don liquid it's not you should dishwasher liquid and um yeah i was reading them comments i was laughing how many y'all around here eating that dirty chicken <laughs> you know that video not the video the that little thing dad had us listen to. Oh yeah. About how the chicken is dirty. Well they just um said today that the what is it, USDA mm -hmm. is allowing the diseased chickens to be sold in the stores. See, and this is why dad doesn't let me cook chicken in the house. So I, I'll respect the rule. <laughs> mm-hmm. They said it today. Well, I don't know when it was published, but I just saw it today. That they're allowing the diseased chickens to be sold. They will ask me to make like things with chicken in my comments sometimes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just like, I can't. It's not allowed in the house. He has a true phobia of, of raw chicken. He just will not. Mmm, that thing cheese it. Mmm. Well, dog, y'all, that was pretty good. I mean, that was real good. I ate that fast. I'm going to put a little tapatio in my tortilla soup. I bet y'all say, what in the... Uh, I know you laugh. I was asking them about uh, Play-Doh's closet. Mm. Oh, that was good. Woo! <clears throat> So yeah. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, them people say they use vinegar, lime, lemon. It was one more strange one I'd, I'd never heard of. But yeah, y'all let me know how y'all clean y'all chicken. Or if you like some people, because she said you don't clean your chicken because you spread the bacteria. Look at Big Messy. Come on, Big Messy. But yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Just a little chill video, y'all. Oh, shoot. Let me ask y'all what um, the thing she sent me. I forgot all about it. So we got. Let me chew this up real quick. Well, it was tearing them sugar cookies up, ain't you? They are so good. <laughs> I tried the pumpkin cookies. I don't like them. You it. don't like them? Why? Are they crunchy? They're so hard. Oh, I like hard cookies. You can have them. I like crunchy hard cookies. I like soft cookies. Oh. Um. Okay, she said, if you... <clears throat> She said, if I ask you to teach me what you're good at, what would I learn? You can answer this one, Keith. Well, if I, I ask so you... many things. So. Girl, bye. <laughs> <laughs> what would I learn from you? Um, teach me what you're good at. I guess the easiest thing I could teach you is cooking. Cooking? Yeah. Let me see what I can teach you. <laughs> Like that. I could teach you how to make Mickey ears. Oh, you did used to make Mickey ears. Teach you how to draw would be too stressful for me. I don't want to learn how to draw. First of all, I don't have the patience. Mm. Mm -mm. I'm gonna make a mess back here. Okay. Oh, the camera's still on. Now, if you ask me which soup is better, lobster bisque or tortilla, lobster bisque is better. Lobster bisque is better. I'm telling you. I told them you liked that uh, lobster bisque from Texas de Brazil because mm. it didn't have the chunks, big chunks of, um, but it didn't have vegetables or anything cut up in it. Yeah, that's why I noticed when I ate the lobster bisque yesterday. Because I was like... The one yesterday had like, like onions, onions, and onions and carrots, and, carrots yeah. and lobster. And so, I still haven't found one better than Cooper's Hog Lobster Bisque. What was that, butter? Yeah, I still haven't found one better, y'all. It's good, but not better. So, if y'all know one, y'all let me know. But yeah, this is just a chill video, y'all. Real quick, something, something. We'll have our seafood again and probably tomorrow. Mm, mm, mm. That bread to get you in trouble, won't it? Oh, mm, goodness. Hey, well, you don't even heat yours up. No, I heat it up now. You're right. Is it, was it good? Yeah. I told you. When you heat that thing up, that press of bread. Told your dad got mad, child, when they stopped serving it on the ship and the chops. <laughs> I don't understand what happened. <laughs> I was like, child, relax. All right. That was it, y'all. We just came to try a little burrow Monday. It's a new fish. Not new fish, but it's a fish I haven't had. <clears throat> What's it called? Burrow Monday. Burl Monday? I don't know. Oh, I thought you were mixing words like something Monday. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I thought that you were doing some kind of theme. Mm, mm, mm. It was really good. I ate all that. And then the sauce that came with it was like a Thai sauce or something. Alright, so thank you guys so much for joining me. I really do appreciate it. Much love, peace, and blessings to each and every one of you. And until the next video, continue making connections with endless possibilities. I love y'all. Bye.
Welcome to the after party. Welcome to the after party. Party. Welcome to the after party. What is it? Uh oh. That is some good coconut water, but baby, when I say it's expensive, it is expensive. That is ten dollars. Ten dollars. No. And the, the one that's half of the size is five dollars. No. No. You went by it. No. Even if you love the way it tastes and love the way it makes you feel. I like juice, but I don't buy that all the time. I don't know not one juice cost ten dollars. I don't think. I don't even like juice that much though. Well, I don't drink a lot of it. That pineapple juice I had was good. Y'all like coconut water. This one is the best tasting one to me. The other ones always taste a little I'm in birds. I am in bears. I don't never be sopping it up. I don't do that, G. All right, y'all. Let me let y'all go. We'll be back tomorrow with a little seafood and stuff. <clears throat> and remember, Monday, we got a new sauce coming out. Can be butter sauce. I'm so excited. I'm so excited to try these new sauces. So we, uh, we're going to try her sauce. I'm so excited. I put it on Instagram. So that'll be coming out Monday. Um, let's see. Oh, I think Monday gonna be a double upload. So please have your post notifications on. Oh, and a lot of people was like, Casey, we didn't get a notification that you went live. Um, y'all check your notification bells and make sure that it's set to all. Cause I don't think if it's if it's not set to all, then you won't get the lives, you won't get the um, community posts, you won't get what else? Premieres, I think. So make sure it's set to all your little bell. And if you don't have the bell, click. Make sure you click the bell. Make sure it's on all. Cause um, a lot of people was like, oh man, I missed the live. I'm mad you missed it too. Well, all right, y'all. Let me let y'all go. Y'all have a good night, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, y'all.